What is up, everyone? Welcome to Horizon Forbidden West. For those of you that are new, I just finished Horizon Zero Dawn and had a fun time with it. And I'm very excited and very glad that I didn't have to wait for this one. <laughs> that, that is for sure. So I don't know what this one has entailed for me. Also didn't watch any trailers on this. But without any more waiting, let's just let's get into it. I'm so excited. <laughs> I was supposed to like wait a little longer to play this. Through a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? The old ones perished a thousand years ago, triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. A little outcast girl, <laughs> ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. I'm worried for silence. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, okay. We gotta pause though. I gotta make sure all the sound is good before we go into it. That's a change, right? Because I used to do quick saves at bonfires. Oh, oh my god, it looks so good. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> oh. <I'm so> happy. <laughs> My beautiful tall necks. They're so cute. I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, they'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. But every time I think I have a lead... It comes to nothing. And every night, I have the same dream. I 
I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. And for a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Varl? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, <laughs> anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. <laughs> well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. <laughs> yeah. Aww. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. <laughs> so, what are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? <laughs> or maybe yeah. it has something to do with the blight. Both, actually, but, um, I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help Lenora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. But you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. <laughs> Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <laughs> A focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. <laughs> Shall we? I'm so excited. <laughs> it looks so good too. It looks so right. amazing. I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. Ooh. Ooh. 
<laughs> I get to play. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, I did get a few These scrapes. These plants Damn. don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. Okay, hold on. I gotta fix a couple more settings before we start. Um, I think I want this to actually be a little higher. Short pulses from your focus highlight valuable loot and resources in the world around you. There. Those plants by the stream should do the trick. Oh, interesting. Ugh. Bitter? Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. Interesting. All right, we should keep going. They're berries. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Oh, I definitely am. Yeah, good idea. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, no, I'm so excited. <laughs> nom nom to all these bushes. I'll be... God, Varley grew up so much. <laughs> oh, when I saw him, I was like, wait a second, is that? <laughs> Woo. Okay. I have no arrows? What? Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, so that's the max we can have for now. Uh, I could eat one, but I don't really need to. I mean, I'll be fine. I'll be good. We know that I got this. We know. Okay, hold on. Just a couple more settings to smooth over. Okay, I think... I think that is all good now. Okay. Interesting. Also, tapping it. Oh, I see. So I can tap it or I could hold it to get back to that. Interesting. Whoa, it showed him too. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, we gotta get to the ruins. I don't remember where they were. <laughs> where are they? Did he point to them? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I guess they're... I'm guessing they're over here. So that's where we came from. God, it looks so good. This game looks so amazing. I'm so excited. I'm ready. I'm ready. Yay. Ground stained red. The blight must be infecting the soil. Hmm. <coughs> hmm. This stuff spreads fast. Six months ago, the land was fine. Now it's everywhere. Damn. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. I see a few ways down. I do too. What are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um, it's an AI. It's, um, it's hard to explain. <laughs> That'd be so it, like, hard to explain. A set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. I don't know how to put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. I've noticed your, uh, life these days yeah I um ran into some trouble on the way here lost a lot of my gear damn <laughs> all my bows <laughs> my hard-earned bows gone So gorgeous, man. I'm just, oh, I can examine this one too. <coughs> the blight's infecting all the plants. It's changing them. If it keeps spreading, nothing will grow. That's why we have to fix it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> yeah. What if it hurt? Oh, it does hurt me to be in there. Okay, we gotta keep that in mind. 
I did not know that. I was like, I wonder if it hurts. <laughs> Takes damage instantly. <laughs> ah, indeed it does. Get out of it. Wait, Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. I know, I will. I will yeah, know. good idea. I'm gonna eat one. God, this water looks so pretty. What's that? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> How do I go back up? Help. I don't know how to go back up. How do I... Guys, this is a problem. I don't know how to swim. Oh, there we go. I was like, I don't know how to swim back up. I was really trying right there. I was like, every button except, of course, the one it would be. It would be the last one I do like the test. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know we could swim, so. I'm a, Oh, God, it looks... Ah! Ah, oh, I'm so excited. Oh, hi. I didn't know you were in here with me. Staying cool in the heat. Anything else? I don't see anything else. Okay, let's go. Machine carcasses as usual, <laughs> and there they go. What's new? Looks like they left a carcass behind. I'm gonna accidentally hit that. <laughs> so much. Okay. Swipe up. Oh, that's really cool. Okay. Okay. I'm I'm keeping track of everything I gotta do. You gotta get used to <laughs> holding it down. Oh, got it. I'm so, I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my god, look at the hair physics. Yeah, I just, I love it. <laughs> the way it flows. A lot of arrows in that machine. Aha, uh -huh, my, my handy dandy Ridgewood. Oh, you can keep some in your inventory. I didn't know that. Oh, shit. That's right. There we go. Let's see if there's anything in here before we hit that. There is. Okay. Let's dive down. Okay. Grab this one. Swim back up before we drown. <laughs> like before. <laughs> I kind of like that so that it doesn't, you know, you don't get always like little markers all the time. I really do like that. We're going to grab all the supplies we can because we know we're going to need them. Yoink them. Yoink everything. Okay. I think I have everything I want now. This is my headphones being a pain. Okay. <laughs> let's let's search you. Damn it. There we go. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? Hmm. I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. Good thing we already picked up some ridgewood. Mm-hmm. I got some arrows now. Ooh, the ancient ruins. Make sure there's nothing else here. God, it looks. I'm so excited. Like, I can't even express <laughs> enough how excited I am. There's a ladder, but can't reach it from here. But nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. I just totally have to target it. the lock. That did it. After you. I'm going up. I like the noise too. Oh, do you hear that? Ooh. <laughs> I 
Okay. Let's get over to the ancient ruins. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission... Mm. The, uh, message I found didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. Ooh. So, um... What happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. Oh god, I'm gonna have to go into this. Oh god. The blight's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals too. No. Then people will get sick too. And starve. We're not gonna let that happen. That is a fact. Some new plants here. What is this one called? Gold Thorn Pepper. Pry open. Oh. Oh, interesting. Ancient Wraith Iron Ingot. Oh, nice. Taking it all. Metal shards, gonna need those. Damn it, I don't think I can get this one. Let's check at the top of it, you know. <laughs> Is there anything else over here? Down this way. Okay, if we gotta go down that way. I don't wanna go that way. Just yet. I wonder how many I can hold in my inventory. And how if I wonder how they refill too. What the fuck is that noise? That's cicada. God, I haven't started cicadas in so long. <laughs> oh, I can't go through there. Too thick. We're gonna need it, that's for sure. Ooh. Get to the grass. Hmm. Never seen one of those before. Yeah. Me neither. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Burrow or detachable. Destroyed when killed. Okay. The sound shell. Oh, it's underneath them. Okay, I was like, where is that one? It's a weak spot. Right. Let's try to hit its butt first, though. I'm ready. Okay, concentrate. Damn it. Varl! <laughs> there we go. I want to knock that off. Okay, did we get it? Oh, it's got long range. <laughs> nice. I wanted to get those... Another spots. one's coming. Oh, I see it. Okay, maybe we can get the bottom part out with this one. This little booty likes to move. There we go. How does the focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of. Ooh! Burrower circulator. So nice. after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. No. Oh. <laughs> oh, my heart. I wonder who else we're gonna see in this. I'm so excited. <laughs> Don't mind me just yoinking all the materials. I don't think I can go down there. I 
I'm ready. Are you ready? Wait, I did break this off. Resource container. Sturdy hard place. I see another ladder. Looks like it's stuck. Did I search this one already? I did not. Machine muscle. Primary nerve as well. There's a lot of new things I'm gonna have to to learn, and I'm excited to learn them. <laughs> Aha. I was like, he said there's another ladder, but I was like, where? <laughs> Not me being blind right away. You said you've had a focus since you were a child, right? Yeah. Yep. Found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. That's a fact. Oh, I'm so glad we got to start this with Varl. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, this is... Hey, look, we're up here now. The correct way. I wonder how many people went into this game without playing the other one. God has protect us. We'll be okay. Through here. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? Far Zenith. I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. <laughs> For our tour of Farzina, of course. Who else is around here? Is it just you? Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Denied? Okay. Hmm. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Yeah. Well, let's find a way in. Oh, yeah, yeah. Very interesting. Just gonna put that out there. I refuse to wait. Please hold for identity scan. What Access denied. Credentials not recognized. Credentials not recognized. I guess he doesn't like me either. Oh, it's him. <laughs> he tried it out. <laughs> I was like, now I'm saying something different. Yeah, it doesn't like either of us. Screw the machine. Is there anything else in here? Nope. Oh, you cut me off. How rude. <laughs> Walked right in front of me. Hmm, chill water. I should be able to pry this open. <laughs> yes, that's exactly my right. <laughs> hmm. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left this here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Hmm. Probably still here, so... Stay on your toes, Varl. Ugh. What's that stench? My entire camp. Wiped out. They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. E. That explains the smell. Looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. Not through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Before we do that, let's check around here, though. Oh, workbench. Wonder if I'll be able to use those. <laughs> so cute. Bam. 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 Dude, it looks so satisfying. The way it moves. <laughs> yeah, I got him. Don't worry. <laughs> He's gone. No need to worry anymore. <laughs> I don't see anything over here. 
don't walk in the <laughs> I'm like trying to avoid landing in the in the acid. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. But... I think I got something. Hmm. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. Mm -hmm. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. I saw a workbench. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Hmm. That would not be a fun way to go. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. Oh, there's some over there, too. Let's go grab that. Then we can put it together at the workbench. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You can use this workbench. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, okay. An improvised version of Delver's prototype tool that can latch on to and pull objects also enables grappling to specific points. Definitely gonna need this. Yeah, let's craft it. Looks like it can be improved, maybe, as well. Pool caster. Nice. There. Uh, pool caster. <laughs> now to right test name. it on the debris. Okay, let's see. The pool caster is a versatile tool that allows you to manipulate objects in the environment that have a graded pattern. Okay. Let's do this. Do I need a sort of tool hold L2 tap triangle? Fire hold R2. Shit. 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 Oh, we gotta hold it. Okay, okay. I was like holding it, <laughs> but not holding it long enough. There we go. Okay. Now we go this side. Not the arrow. <laughs> Triangle, then this. Okay. We got this. Come on. That worked better than I Easy. thought. <laughs> Good work. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. What's hmm. this? Huh. What's this thing for? Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Mm -hmm. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please, proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. To the auditorium? Up there? Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out. Hmm. And why would they not let Elizabeth... Why would they not be on good terms? Okay, let's see. Welcome to Farzina. Let's see. Let's go back over here really quick. Is there anything over here? Hmm. It looks wild. <laughs> Just zooming in on you while I look around. 
I don't see anything else. Ah, huh. I do. I might be able to get up there. Grapple point. What's this? Well, that door looks promising. Bunker door, rope but ladder. How do I get up there? You go up and around. Let's just make sure there's nothing else over here first. Okay, yeah. Let's go. Okay, so uh, jump and tap. Oh, okay. Nice. Wow, <laughs> that works. That pole caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, <laughs> I'll find you another one. Get way left behind. <laughs> Nothing over here. Is this something? No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Just like making sure none of the controls have changed <laughs> too much. Okay, so I don't see anything. Let's drop that. Okay. Awesome. I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. We. There you go, Varl. Thanks. Hey, now you can come up here. Okay, time to search the ancient ruins. sapiens us we have always pushed the boundary as explorers pioneers trailblazers and now far zenith is taking the next leap into the future that's why we're proud to have resurrected the odyssey when our governments abandoned in orbit far zenith will actualize in less than a decade but that's only the beginning when the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. Is that a star? The serious system. There will create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chinvumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. Damn it. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Mmm, terraforming colony. Error. Make sure the Earth or the presentation file corrupted. And it's survivable. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability. New bio contagions. Rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Mm -hmm. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. 
Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how... yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity... it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Ooh, so excited. <laughs> so yeah, that was interesting. So they're looking at investors, of course. The wilds have really grown over the this place. Thing. And I guess they were going to somehow preserve them in a way, which is very curious. Okay, we can go that way. Or wait, how do I do it? My focus might be X. able to help here. Wait, was it X? Yep. Shit, wait, what was I? Oh, it was X, okay. <laughs> Show I just wasn't high enough. <laughs> eh. Whoop. You jealous, huh? <laughs> Come on, you got it. Jesus. <laughs> Deeper into Beautiful. the creepy room we go. <laughs> Sounds like my kind of adventure. Okay, we gotta stay out of that though. I don't wanna. Ooh. Oh, what is that? Thing? <laughs> I don't know if I wanna know. I'm gonna kill this awesome. Keep your guard up. Ooh, it's like a oh, snake. My guard is up. A giant snake. That. Oh, <coughs> Damn it. <laughs> I knew I was going to be too close to it. Oh, Up here. <laughs> Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. <laughs> you take the left one, I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. I can throw a rock to distract it. Get it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. Time to throw. I think we should actually wait. Until it comes back over here. No, that was not R2. <laughs> it says to hold R2. I'm confused. Oh, it, and now, okay. It just would not let me use it. Okay, <laughs> that explains a lot. I've been trying to get it to, to press, but... Hey, you come over here. Oh, there. No, I have to take it down with the spear strike. That was odd. Come here. You can't see me. Destroy. You get that one? Gotcha. Mine's down too. Pick up my rock. I'm taking it back. Try it again. Okay, I see now. I thought I had to hold it and kind of like in, like when you used to do it before, you would hold it down and throw it that way. <laughs> so I was so confused. I'm like, what am I doing wrong? That 
But we got it. Oh. It's another rock. I'm gonna need all the rocks I can get. What do you got on you? Metal bone. Throw nerve. Machine core. Metal shards. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle. Ain't that a fact? Oh, definitely saw me. On your lead. Interesting, uh, attack. <laughs> gotcha, though. <laughs> Perfect position for me to just stab you in the bum. <laughs> nice. Is there any more of them? I think so. I think we're good. Maybe. <laughs> oh wait, I think I hear one. Oh, down there. You got that one? I've been meaning to mention, I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. No. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. I'm what? sorry my whiskers offend you. I, I think it looks you. great. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. Let's see if we got it. God, I just love the colors. This game is so gorgeous. So pretty. I love it already. <laughs> oh. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight. Oh, no. I couldn't escape. I hope it didn't suffer long. So that's the way to go. We should make sure there's nothing up here first. Before we go over there. Oh shit, there is something. Ow, I fell. <laughs> I see something. Or am I crazy? Oh, it's right there. I see it. <laughs> it's a little plant. It's okay. Oh shit. Run right into it. We, we don't talk about that. <laughs> it didn't happen. Okay. I think that was... Where am I going? That way, okay. I got turned around. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Interesting. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. There's a ton here. I didn't even notice these ones. I'm gonna grab what I can so that we have enough arrows to make. I'll keep this for later. Nice. Guess that Osram didn't have a chance to use it. Can Careful. overheal past Traps your ahead. max health? Oh, might oh, be shit. able to disarm them. <laughs> I was like, please don't explode in my face. Managed to well, some supplies. And not That's blow so yourself cute. up. Dismantled it. And got more supplies. Nice. Look, we already have 230 metal shards. Hell yeah. Doing good. 
doing good so far. <laughs> Looks like another camp. Oh, While yeah. we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. Hold down, open your hunter's kit to navigate the blast trap. Oh, I don't have the right supplies to And that's why we're not holding down anymore to throw the rocks. Looks like the Osram shot off some machine parts. I might be able to scrounge up enough materials from them. Sounds like a plan. Let's see what we have around here. Dude, I'm just beating up those four <laughs> little tests. Oh, but look. It's just so satisfying watching them break. <laughs> I just enjoy it so much. The way the, the bucket head jiggles. Like, that's so satisfying. <laughs> it's like breaking pots in a Souls game. I can use this. Okay. And that? I should have what I need to craft a trap. Okay, let's see. There. Should I craft another one? Trap made. Hell yeah. If anything walks into one of those. Another one. <laughs> there we go. Over here. Oh, I didn't hey, need to, but. I think I see a way up. Do you? Okay, hold on. Let me grab this. Ooh, this is like a sideways building <laughs> throwing me off. Making me dizzy. Oh. Machine's head. Ooh. Don't think they spotted us. I better scan them. I agree. Let's see. I kind of like this. I, I can go between all their different weaknesses without. Let's see where its weak points are. Like you know, without one of those traps having to focus on it specifically. Power cell. Let's see. Highlight track. Okay. Um. Oh, you can tag a specific part, too. A little booty. Detachable. I actually like that a lot. Um, or I could just... We'll trap the other one. When he goes back. I don't know how this is gonna work, but we're gonna try it. Set this here. <laughs> and then we're gonna watch him explode. <laughs> Let's go over here. <laughs> Get a good angle on this. Come over here. Come over here, little scrounger. Come on, hurry up. I want to watch you explode. <laughs> Walk over there already. Do it. I gotta see it. I gotta see my little hot air balloon. <laughs> nah, that's what you get. Let's keep going then. Grab what we can first, though. There is a lot of stuff around here. And I You've been in a lot of old world ruins. Are they all like this? Well, they all have their secrets, yeah. but every place is different. <laughs> I'm gonna end up having like a two thousand Ridgewood like I did at the beginning of my first playthrough. <laughs> But then I stopped picking up Ridgewood, and then I started running out of Ridgewood, so... <laughs> I guess... <laughs> there was no balance for me in between. It was either too much or none at all. Should be a way to get up there. Aha, uh -huh, I see. Wait, there's more stuff over here, too. I have so much that I'll, I'll be able to sell off. All these ancient items. Up we go! We. <laughs> Oh my god. Ooh, that is, oh god, I thought this whole place was crashing down. 
else around here before we go nope i think we are good to go oh i'm so excited man i don't know why i'm just That's like a big storm picking whew, up out there ready <laughs> yeah and they're getting stronger and more frequent so the storms the blighted lands the rivers and lakes choked with algae you were born to fix all that yeah but i can only do it if i find that backup that's a lot winding our way around to the data center to have on you need to cut through that big building on the right out there one thing i didn't uh mention or talk about yet was the dream that she had i found that really interesting that she was dreaming about uh elizabeth hey varl there's data here you scan it with your focus <gasps> oh my god zero dawn trade agreement High Council Executive Summary. Negotiations with representatives from Zero Dawn have concluded, and I am exceptionally pleased that we've arrived at a mutually profitable agreement. It shows that sugar goes down better than salt, in contrast to the less tactful recommendations of certain of our more reactionary members. In short, Far Zenith will provide a copy of the prototype Homer archive already sent, 500 ectogenic chambers to be retrieved from storage at our Ninma facility. Supplementary, supplementary ectogenesis research reports. In exchange, Far Zenith will receive a copy of the alpha build of the Apollo database in the week prior to the Odyssey's launch. By our estimates of Zero Dawn's timeline, by then it should be near complete. Repository of human knowledge. It should be noted that Dr. Sobek was very reluctant to agree to this, but I drew a line in the sand, making it clear that this was a non-negotiable term. As our faithful media representative, I will continue to run all public communications with Dr. Sobek's team while data corrupted. This data mentions the tech that Far Zenith traded with Zero Dawn. It doesn't explain how they got it back up. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Let's see. Huh. A lot of glyphs. I'll tuck this away to study later. <laughs> Understandable. <laughs> Anything else in here? Oh, cool. It's like a, a bigger thing in my focus. I do like that. Easier to see. Here's some water. I've had a, like a really bad cough the last couple of days. Looks like we've got to climb up. We going up? I can't reach that ladder from here. Bye. So we can climb up there, we can go down there, we can climb up that way. There's so many options. <laughs> Which do I choose? Um, what's over here? Hmm. I'll climb up this way first. Let's see where this has. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You okay? Yeah, not that way. Guess we won't be going that way. What about here? Oh, this place is really falling apart. That's a fact. <laughs> well, it is a thousand years old. <laughs> hmm. Before I go into there. Let me just see what's down here. That looks like the way we came. Okay, okay. <laughs> Thanks, Marl. <laughs> I'm just double checking. I'm like, have I been there before? <laughs> Up we go. <laughs> oh, oh, hi. <laughs> Lovely seeing you. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. Nice of you to pass by. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's locked. For now. Anything else in here? Maybe that thing at the table does something. Okay, 
don't think I see There's anything There's another else. one of those glowing things by the table. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering. An obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, oh, <laughs> she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. So they stole a copy of Gaia right under their noses. Dr. Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Hmm. Uh, um, it's okay, bro. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that it's called gaia and for a long time she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself so she made me to bring her back i'm the only one who can and this place is my last hope you once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into all mother mountain was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Laurel. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Poor Boral. He is like, what is going on? He's so confused. <laughs> it's okay, Boral. We were there too. That was us in Zero Dawn. Okay. <laughs> Intel update. Evya Hayui? I probably messed up that name and I'm very sorry. June 1st, 2065. Esteemed members of the High Council. The latest intelligence report is attached. I expect I'll have another update at the end of the week. FY. Attachment. Elizabeth Sobek. All sources indicate Dr. Sobek continues to work obsessively on Gaia's development, pushing herself to psychological and physical exhaustion. Despite managing a large team, our sources note that she spends most of her time in isolation, which is consistent with her previous documented habit habits detailed fully in her main file. Conclusions. Dr. Sobek remains unaware of Project Anzu. Sources will continue monitoring for any changes in behavior. Ted Faro. Mr. Farr continues to exhibit extreme guilt and psychological instability. His savior complex, detailed in his main file, renders him incapable of dealing with his culpability for the impending extinction of life on Earth. While his attention is largely preoccupied with the construction of Thebes, our source confirmed he recently coerced Tank Shaw into installing a secret backdoor into the Zero Dawn system, capable of supersending Alpha Authority. It is unclear what Mr. Farrow intends to accomplish with this, 
but while it may pose a risk down the line to Zero Dawn's success, it should not impact Anzu's goals. Conclusion? Irrelevant to Farzina's aims, no further action necessary. Hank Shaw. The latest check-in with Mr. Shaw confirms he is continuing work in his role as a project beta of the Haiti subordinate function, and his connections to our organization have gone undetected. He has demanded premium accommodation for his birth on the Odyssey, which was agreed to. Conclusion, Mr. Shaw is on target to deliver a copy of Gaia. After transmission, he will be removed from the equation prior to the Odyssey's launch. Refer to the action plan. So wait. He will be removed from the equation. Well, aren't you lovely? <laughs> of course, you know. <laughs> Ted Farrow with his, his savior complex. <laughs> yeah, that's why he killed everyone. All the alphas, uh-huh, yeah. Of course. Because <laughs> he's got some problems, and it wouldn't surprise me if he caused a lot more than what we saw. But, man. Oh, huh. I was like midair when I read that. <laughs> that. Aloy, <laughs> over here. I'm here. I found something you could use. Ooh, what's this? A weapon. Thanks, Varl. We should keep moving. After you. Blasting launch bombs that affect large areas. This weapon fires frost bombs. Use them against enemies to build up the frost brittle state. While in the brittle state, enemies are more vulnerable to hard point air impact damage. Nice. Nice. And ah, that's why we kept picking up chill water. <laughs> it's all it's all coming together. I have max though, which is nice. Open the door. Damn, this is so gorgeous. <sighs> Down here. We. I think we're almost back outside. Good. Now, before we go on, I want to open this and just. Kind of get a look at everything really quick. Oh, so this is our new skill system. Machine Master, Infiltrator, Survivor, Hunter, Trapper, Warrior. Hmm. I'll have to look at that later. Inventory, outfits, tools, ammo, resources. Valuables to sell. Oh, thank God. <laughs> organized. This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> I love when things are very organized. We got healing items. We have food resources. I wonder how much I can hold of everything. Like, am I coming up on my max? Who knows? Or is it like I can only hold so much on me and then it's in a box? I think that's what it might be. Maybe. I could be wrong. Because I definitely have more than 100 uh, Ridgewood, I'm pretty sure. Maybe. Yeah. Definitely. And I have more. Oh, well, maybe I don't. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. Special gear. Map. Quests. Oh, that's so pretty. What a gorgeous quest menu. Notebook. Cool. Wait, where's my... Oh, there it is. Character bios. Interesting. Varl, Nora warrior. Varl is a warrior from the rustic Nora tribe. His mother, Sona, is the tribe's war chief, known for her iron will and her stern disposition. She trained him to become, become skilled in... Fuck. <laughs> I lost it now. Become a skilled hunter with his little sister, Vala, following in their footsteps. When the Milton cult known as the Eclipse murdered a number of Nora youth, including Vala, Varl teamed up with Aloy to exact revenge. Or vengeance, sorry. Since then, the two have shared a bond, fueled by mutual respect and common values. 
They fought side by side in a number of engagements culminating in the Battle of the Alight, in which the Eclipse were finally vanquished along with their buried shadow and rogue AI known as Hades. When Aloy vanished after the battle, Varl tracked her into the wilderness. Although they shunned her as an outcast, her, his tribe now believes that she's the anointed, destined to carry out the will of All Mother, their goddess. As such, he feels a spiritual responsibility to assist her that goes beyond a mere friendship. Hi, Varl. <laughs> See, I think this is for people that might have not played the first game. I guess, maybe? I mean... Yeah, because we already... Like, we know all of this. Interesting. Okay, sorry. I just wanted to check all that out. <laughs> mm, I'm so excited. <laughs> I can't stop saying Look, it because I just said it. It's heading in the same direction we're going. Mm, lovely. Great. I'm terrified. <laughs> I'm concerned. <clears throat> Like I need a drop to that ledge. Who do you think I am, game? Machines. I could try out that new weapon on it. I guess so. I can do more damage to it while it's brittle. I better switch uh. to my bow. It's already brittle, Aloy. Gotcha. Nice. Couldn't take the cold. <laughs> Did I shoot off its butt? I don't know. The awesome Delvers. And a lot of acid. That big machine must have attacked as they tried to escape. They didn't stand a chance. Looks like we can cross over here. Let me just grab a couple of these. Oh, we can't search it. Hmm. So, you said this backup is the last hope. Hopefully. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months, there were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow purged them all. Because he's he part such... of Far Zenith too? No. He was worse. <laughs> Ain't that a fact? Okay, what am I looking for? Nearby climbing. Ah, that's right. Nearby climbing holes. I don't see any. <laughs> Maybe I'm just blind. Ah, no, that was him. Maybe I can do it here better. I don't really see anything like. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> this one. Maybe we can see something from here. Aha! A grapple point. And there's one right there, too. Yeah, I just couldn't see it where I was before. Is this gonna hurt? No. <laughs> I wasn't too sure. <laughs> it's kind of far. Mm hmm. Oh, I could just. Oh, shit. Damn it. <laughs> I fucked up. 
<laughs> we won't talk about it. Nice. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Jesus, wait for me. Calm down. <laughs> He's like more excited than I am. Up we go. Wow. Ooh, that big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the stars in that. Hmm. New data point. The Delver's Journal. A journal filled with hastily scrawled glyphs. Day one. We descended into the valley and reached the ruins. Boss always had a good sense for delve sites, and by the forge he was right. This place is untouched. Had to knock down a few machines while we were moving our gear. Pesky thing kept popping up out of the ground, but otherwise we've got the whole place to ourselves. Set up camp near the main entrance. Far, far roof nearly jumped out of his skin when he dropped his hammer and it went a clinging down the stairs. Kid's first delve, I reckon. Even if he swears otherwise, he's lucky this one's above ground at least. Day two, pushed further into the ruins. Boss tested out his latest prototype that he called Hook and Pool. Ah, <laughs> great names. <laughs> Name needs to work on exactly, <laughs> if you ask me. I showed Far Farouf a simple trick to evaluate salvage. The less it's rusted, the higher a price it'll fetch at Meridian. All in all, a good day. Until he insisted he saw the trees shaken across the river. Kids jumpier than a frog on hot coals. Day four. Felt a deep rumble in the dead of night. Land shake, maybe. But it's got a whole crew on edge. Boss overheard. Boss ordered half of us to set up a second camp further in. Figures we'll pick this place clean faster if we split up. No arguments there. Think I'll set up training dummies for Faroof. Kid can barely hold his own up against a burrower. Only a few of us left. Kid didn't make it. Machine blasted him with an acid at the river crossing. Can hear it slithering outside. A few more minutes rest, then we're going to make a run for it. Damn. More Osram. Machines tore right through them. These guys couldn't catch a break. No, they could not. That poor kid. <laughs> I see nothing. What if I just played this game all night? I mean, what would happen eh? <laughs> if I ahead. just kept playing? We can tag them oh, in the focus to keep track of them. Aha! Uh -huh. Interesting. It's only them two. God, I think like my allergies are just killing me today. <laughs> Help. <laughs> it is that that time of year. Maybe I should keep my window closed. But it gets so hot in here when I have my computer and my PlayStation on at the same time. It's like having a goddamn furnace in your room. I need I should have tracked him on his there it is. Where did both come in this way? Look at these little gooses. my kill that I was gonna search? <laughs> Excuse me? Hey, what up? The return of the death bush is happening. You can't- oh, there's another one. I did not notice you. Nice. Where's the other one I killed? 
Oh, that was it. Okay. Cool. Machine ripped right through the wall. I'm sure that's not all it can do, too. There's a ladder in the back. Grab what we can before we go. What is that? What's in here? Some more valuables. Some more bushes. Anything else, though? I see nothing. Hmm. Oh, he didn't. Okay. <laughs> Because the thing went away when he touched it, but I think it was just my thing going away. <laughs> so I was like, man, he looted the corpse I was going to loot. Okay, I think we're good. Let's get out of here. Definitely machines out there. So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you yeah, I was going say back that to too. the sacred lands. As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. <laughs> Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. You know? Me neither. I think I've seen her smile maybe once, and I think it was during like Revenge of the Nora, maybe. And I can't even remember if she did. <laughs> I can't, I don't know now. <laughs> we'll get her to smile. We'll do it. Tell her some, some of my bad jokes and hopefully make her laugh. <laughs> we all know I have the worst jokes. Oh my god. They are like snakes. I love snakes. Look. Three of those things. But man, they look scary. <laughs> and if they slaughtered all those Osram, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. And they're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. But I kind of want to take that thing. Up. How? I'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> and there she goes. <laughs> Wee! Let's go. I'm excited. Now, I'm on my own. You gotta be careful. Quiet. I can make it to the tower. I should be able to find a way across to the shuttle. Is it just you over here, little guy? Hey, look, a trophy already earned. <laughs> All the stealth kills. Something else is this? Wait, something else hear me? Oh, oh shit. Stick to my spear for now. Save some ammo. Wham! Hell yeah. I was like, what hurt me? <laughs> I was a little confused for a second. Going for my supply box, I see. We need to go that way. Doesn't know I'm here just yet. I mean, I can make a lot of ammo, so I'm not too concerned about it. There's a lot of stuff here, too. Yep. 
Gotta make sure to stay out of that. <laughs> Thought I would go that way. Let's see. A metal ladder. I see, I see. Oh, I see it now. There we go. I gotta get in there first, but let me just yoink that. I don't think I picked it up. Oh, I did, okay. There. That ladder can get me up to the tower. Damn it. <laughs> I missed it. <laughs> Jumped right past it. Okay, now... Uh-huh, you see that? There's a wall up there. I think I can reach it if I launch myself off that grapple point. Okay, jump and tap X. Tap O before reaching the grapple point. Okay. Nice, okay. So I'm gonna have to get. <laughs> I'm gonna have to remember that. <laughs> That's gonna be a hard one to remember. So many new things I'm so excited to, to try out. Those little chests are hidden if you don't <laughs> press down, they are hard to see. Uh-huh. Hopefully none of this falls on me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, like I said. <laughs> Probably just well, jinxed it myself. <laughs> cool, cool. It's all good. The storm's getting bad. <laughs> I don't like storms. Made it. tower down on to the next yeah yeah <laughs> it's a little close to the ledge there you're doing these climbs sometimes it freaks me out but there is a cable here maybe i can ride it to the other side uh... Uh... Oh, well, Get up here quick. <laughs> oh my god this place is better than together that's a fact. <laughs> Get me out of here. <laughs> oh, that was so scary. <laughs> Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. Oh, but there's a control console nearby. Hmm. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall right into the basin. Sounds like a good plan to me. Now, whether it goes as planned is a whole nother story. <laughs> One can help, though. That machine muscle I thought was onions for a second. Oh, great. <laughs> it looked like an the onion. Machines in my way. Yeah, we got this though. This one there's one nearby too. Trust that bush? Oh shit. Back into my death bush. Ooh. The valuable box. Hey you. Come over here. It's a thing to tell me I'm hidden here. Because I'm not too sure if I am. <laughs> I think I am. Okay. 
Got this place to myself now. Definitely feel safer. <laughs> Control console might be in there. Before I go in there, though, is there anything else? Okay, I don't think so. I think we are good. Other than some some Ridgewood <laughs> stacking up <laughs> already in my inventory. <laughs> Okay, time to crush those machines down below. If it hopefully, oh, I think it will. Hmm. They look like they have poison. They're venomous. Come on. The shuttle's caught up in those cables. Damn it. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. Great. Ooh. I love climbing towers that look like they're about to fall apart. <laughs> That's my favorite thing to do. Scanning with my I pull that beam down, it might drop the access lift. Pull it, come on. Great. Lovely. Up we go, I guess. Because <laughs> this isn't crazy at all. Not at all. <laughs> I'm scared. Might as well use the staircase, right? <laughs> Grab what I can. Oh, I totally missed it. Okay, the creeping doesn't sound good. I have to detach those cables quick. Okay, don't stress me out. <laughs> where am I going? Oh, Jesus. Wait, isn't this where I came from? Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. I guess it wasn't. Can make this. this should be the right spot. There, that connector is holding the cables together. It should break if I shoot it. Nice. Do have to hit any others? I just need to climb higher and attach the second set of cables. I see it. Scaling an ancient rickety tower with killer machines waiting down below. Sounds like a typical right. day for us. But no turning back now. <laughs> climb, climb, climb. Whee. that way <laughs> but I was not <laughs> it looked like the perfect thing to grab on there there's the other connector we won't talk about it <laughs> I didn't miss I, I swear I hit the target perfectly
Hell yeah, we made it. <laughs> Perfectly planned as usual. Ooh, that one looks like it's still kind of alive. Oh no. Finishing this the hard way. Okay, where's that weak spot? That sack's full of acid. I should target it first. Where is it? I see it, but how do I do I get this? Oh shit, I'm running out of ammo. Oh my Jesus Christ, I left in me. Oh, nice. There. Those canisters are exposed now. I should aim for them. Oh. Oh, it's got a little stinger too. It looks like. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> It broke free. I've got to take this thing down fast. Trap, maybe. Frost ammo. True. I do have that. When my focus might find something I can use around here. Ow. That cloak in here. Oh, God. His tail is insane. God, he is, like, just so agile. My least favorite. He's almost dead. Nice. I think. Easy. There's probably something he's dead. Could have used, but finally. I just wanted to fight it <laughs> myself. I'd say it went pretty good. The data center should be straight ahead. I guess we're all gonna have to find another way there. He's got it. He's, he'll be fine. Aha! Uh -huh. I see. I could use this. Sorry, I was testing something. It makes it when you're holding down, like the actual hold down of the R2. It's harder to press with that. Anyone else knows that? Just me? I don't know. Yeah, because it's like easy when I do this, but when I have the bow, it's like a little harder. And then when I have that weapon, it's even harder to press down the the trigger. Interesting. I didn't notice that before. Nice. Anything else around here that I should grab? Ah, uh, another one. See, but I wanted to kind of fight it with my bow, just to practice <laughs> aiming again. <laughs> Get used to the aiming in this one, and the different weak spots and stuff. Let's just grab everything really quick. Oh, the music's so peaceful now. How nice. Dude, the music in this game and in Zero Dawn was just incredible, honestly. I was like, I'm very lost of where I need to go. <laughs> I was like, where, where am I going? You're almost there. 
Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia. Fix the system, heal the Blight. Restore Elizabeth's dream. But is it still there? Okay. I should find the server room. Nice. Hmm. Places. It'd be creepy right now. <laughs> Why'd it get creepier? I preferred it when it wasn't creepy. I'm close. Oh, shit. I have to be. Let's grab what we can before that. Hmm. What to do about Dalgard? Data corrupted. On the matter of Mr. Dalgard, he's been a valuable member of Far Zenith for years. Even Peter saw the need for polished spokesmen to preserve anonymity for the rest of us. But with all the new members we recruited to increase funds for the Odyssey's expedition timeline, there are simply not enough berths on the ship to accommodate. Cuts have been made, and let's face it, Oswald lacks the skill set for future aims. He'll retaliate if we exclude him, of course, so we'll have to give him a proper send-off, but that doesn't mean that his usefulness must end. We have plenty of source material to generate a digital puppet, giving us um, the means to give me the rest of it. <laughs> Damn, so they are just getting rid of Oswald. That's... <laughs> I'm sure that went very well. <laughs> we have Anything else before I go? I don't think so. We made it. It's here. Oh my god. Gaia version 6.9. Initializing. Hello. Hi. Elizabeth? Travis Tate. Now, what's this we got here? A far as in the conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia? And her subordinate functions? Naughty, naughty. You want me to handle this, Liz? <laughs> Blasphemers, brood of vipers, with a mighty hand I smite and pour troubles upon you. He <laughs> <laughs> <You> wouldn't. <laughs> you, <laughs> you gotta love it, though. <laughs> this ain't no copy of guy you stole, you losers. But it's the mother of all logic bombs. So good luck repairing your data. And next time you start thinking you can outsmart a tape, remember my salute. <laughs> okay, I got it. It's pretty good though. <laughs> as much as we need in Gaia right now. I'm sorry. Hey, Lloyd. The goddess. <laughs> there is no goddess. No. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. Poor Aloy. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. No. I got it. For all... I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know? But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um... There's going to be more of that. 
I'm out of leads, Farl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farl. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <laughs> yes, I agree. Sign me up. <laughs> I, I guess it's worth a shot. We've got no. a long walk ahead. No. Actually, I've got a better idea. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, I'm going to call that part there. Uh, I'm so excited. I'm going to keep playing, so. <laughs> but that part's going to get quite long, so I got to cut it so that it can render out correctly. Um, I'm having so much fun. This is so exciting. I can't wait to just get into the open world and explore, so I'm, I'm very excited. <laughs> Huge thanks to all my patrons, and I will see you guys in the next one.